Um, today I'm a little out of it today, so I'm not going to be as enthusiastic as I was yesterday. But today's video I wanted to talk about, I'm going to pull up my phone. Uh, I was received an article today about how apparently Apple may be releasing a MacBook Air. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, I, uh, it says here that Apple may release a brand new uh, MacBook Air with a fresh redesign. And apparently everyone's saying that the MacBook Air could be the budget-friendly MacBook that the lineup needs. Now, first I want to talk about the MacBook Air. The whole idea of the MacBook Air was to create a portable, lightweight MacBook that people can buy, obviously. However, if you look at the lineup that we have now, we have the MacBook, the MacBook Pro, and then we have the MacBook Air. Now, the MacBook Pro is portable, but it's very powerful and it's very expensive. The MacBook itself is expensive, but ultra portable. And the MacBook Air is pretty much a middle in between. The budget friendly, but also pretty lengthy and pricey. Now, if they release a refresh of the MacBook Air, I would expect them to give it a brand new design. Get, knock those bezels off and probably do some implementations to keep the price down as well. However, I don't think they should refresh the MacBook Air, and I'm gonna tell you why. I'm not saying it's the worst idea in the world, I'm not saying it's terrible, and if anything, they probably should. The reason I say they shouldn't refresh it is because they already have a MacBook that can be the MacBook Air. The 2017 MacBook, 2018, whatever you wanna call it. That MacBook, is ultra light, ultra portable, and it does everything that the MacBook Air already does. It has better processors, It ha even though it has a lack of ports, it has USB Type-C, it has a brand new speaker, it has the butterfly keys, if you're a fan of the butterfly keys, just saying. And ultimately, if Apple were to come down on the price for the MacBook, put that in slot for the MacBook Air. Call that MacBook the MacBook Air. It would make sense, but at the same time, it would throw people off. Because people would then say, but you called that the MacBook. How is this going to be the MacBook Air? It is very tricky. But at the same time, I can also see being um, in the lineup as well. The only thing is the MacBook Air needs to feature a lot of things in order to pretty much make it justifiable. Meaning, if the MacBook Air comes out, they give it a brand new design, they take away all the ports, which is probably unlikely, but you never know. You need to charge it anyway. If they were to do that, they would be going in the route of the MacBook. So do you see what I'm saying? They could just kill the MacBook Air or rename the MacBook, the 2017 MacBook, the MacBook Air. Say that takes the place of the MacBook Air, lower the price, since the CPU performance on there is about average, pretty decent. Um, and just keep it simple. You've got three Macs. The standard MacBook, the 13-inch MacBook, and the 15-inch MacBook. That would simplify the lineup as well. Now, I'm not saying eliminate the MacBook Air by all means, but you also have to think of it from a common sense point of view. If they're going to refresh the design, it's going to be way too similar to the MacBook. So in a way, you would kind of think, we just rename it, but we'll see. But you never know. Apple could probably just give it brand new processors, probably give it a brand new screen, and who knows? Maybe there's some features that they can do for the MacBook Air and make it better. But from what I'm seeing right now, I don't know if they could pull that off. I think they should just rename the MacBook, the MacBook Air, and give that, that title and price it at what the MacBook Air was worth. That's what I would think. But you never know. So we have to see what Apple pulls out of the bag. But that's all I wanted to say. It was just a rumor, and I kind of wanted to give my opinion on that. So that's going to do it for this video. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what do you think of the MacBook Air. Is it going to get a refresh? And also, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss the next episode or any videos that I make. Thanks for watching, and peace.